Guess who's back? Back again. It is your boy Sean P. Back with another video. And this is not really another video because it's been a cool minute actually since I've done a video. I've been so busy kind of like fighting with Bruce Bannon and going back and forth with him that I've kind of lost focus on doing my videos. But uh, first off, welcome to my channel, Sean P. Reviews. And if this is your first time uh, watching this video, thank you for watching. And if, you, if you're subscribed, thank you for subscribing to my channel. And today's video is my year update. i am be honest with y'all. I don't know what week I'm on. I think I'm on week 39, week 38, week 40. I don't know. I'm going to look it up and I'm going to put the uh, uh, the right week on this video. But uh, what is there to update on the year? Um, nothing, pretty much. I mean... Nothing's really changed other than the fact that I've ran out of uh, multivitamin. I need to get an another one or choose another one or go with a uh, different multivitamin than what I've been using. Uh, biotin, I haven't been taking. Um, I just haven't been taking it. Water, I haven't been drinking enough of. Uh, what else haven't I done in the last month? I've, I've, I've fell off a lot. And my whole point of the whole year experience is to be completely transparent with y'all and tell y'all my struggles and my triumphs with my year. And um, nothing's really changed other than the fact that I just haven't been taking supplements, haven't been drinking enough water, haven't really exercised enough, even though I do exercise. I, I mean, I, I you know play ball and stuff and, you know, push-ups, you know, pull-ups here and there. But other than that, I haven't really been taking the steps necessary to optimize my beard uh, growth. And I'm kind of really okay with that because I'm not in it just for just one year. I'm in it for the long haul. So I'm not really worried about, you know, it not growing. Now I, I'm kind of want to get like, and I do have beard envy. I'm not going to, I'm not going to lie to y'all. I have beard envy when I see beard Samson. I have beard envy when I see a uh, bearded existence and hopefully down the line, I'll have a beard like that, but I got to be patient. So I'm going to be patient with the process and just let it grow. But um, I kind of wanted to talk about the topic of the struggles of a curly beard. Now, as you can tell by my check, uh, my, my hair texture is super curly, especially on the sides. My beard actually appears longer than what it really is for the simple fact that I have a super curly, coily, kinky beard. And... Um, People that have, you know, this type of hair texture would kind of relate to this. But um, when I first started growing my year out, uh, I was all about, oh, I'm not going to trim it, man. I'm, I'm going to let it grow. I'm going to, you know, I'm going to do it. I'm just, I'm just not going to trim it. And I did that. I did that for maybe the first maybe like four months in before I actually maybe trimmed like a single strand knot before I actually really started kind of cutting into the beard. And... I feel that's necessary if you're really starting out growing your beard. You might not want to trim it for a while, maybe a good three to four months before you actually hack at it. But I feel that in my opinion, and this is just my opinion, that if you have a super curly beard, I feel it's necessary for you to actually trim uh, every once in a while, especially if you're getting the dead ends and you're getting single strand knots and you're getting split ends and breakage and all that stuff. So. I feel it's necessary to actually trim a super curly beard during a year. And I know some people might not want to hear that, especially if you're growing your year out. Man, I'm going a, I'm to a grow my beard and I ain't going to trim it. But if you have a super curly beard, you might actually have to trim it to ensure the health of your beard. And um, I really have no like issues trimming it because... For the simple fact that I'm not, I'm not, you know, just growing my beard out just for a year. I'm growing it out for like the rest of my life. Like, I, like, if I was to shave this all off right now, I probably would like just freak out and like, you know, I would feel like I'm naked pretty much. And, um, I, I see myself doing, you know, growing a beard out for a, a very, very long time, unless I absolutely have to trim it. And somebody's going to have to pay me a, like a lot of money to do that. And, um, but I feel it's necessary to trim your beard, especially if you have a super curly beard and I don't really stress on trimming it for the simple fact that it's going to grow back. You know, your hair is going to grow back. Now, 
depending on how long it takes for you to grow back, it just depends on the person. So, I mean, I, I, I could trim at this right now and not freak out about trimming it because I know it's going to grow back. Now, as such, trimming it, don't get me wrong, because you think in your mind, you know, mentally, man, all the work you put into like growing the beard out and a little inch here and, you know, a little hair there. You, you think about that stuff when you trimming your beard. But I'm here to tell you, man, don't don't worry about this stuff because it's going to grow back. It's hair is going to grow back unless you just are going bald and that's on top of your head. Like this, like this, like my afro, I'm, I don't worry about, uh, you know, um, me trimming anything because I know it's going to grow back. Now, this I have not touched. I have not touched my afro in uh, nine months. So, but I'm here to tell y'all that do not be afraid to trim your beard if you have a super curly beard. It is going to grow back even though it sucks having to trim because of all the work that you put in. And um, yeah, that's pretty much it on the update. It's nothing really major. Uh, like I said, I don't know what really honestly what week I'm in right now because of the simple fact that I haven't really been posting these videos on the regular. So, but I'm gonna put the right week of my year on the video. But uh, I'm gonna go ahead and sum up, uh, sum up this video. Please like, comment, subscribe. And I'm out. Peace. Cut the camera off, Sean. It's about time you did a video, Sean. Come on, man. You've been slacking.